What you're looking at is one of the gorgeous Ferraris here at the Auto Show, part of the evolution of Ferrari display. Joining me now, Rick Walker, executive producer and host of Street Sport Television on CTV2. Morning. Good morning. Those are some good looking vehicles. They are. Um, it's like rolling sculpture. I agree. And I think that it's realistic to say that one day I will drive this red beauty here. What do you think? Um, you know, some of these cars are actually within reach. These are collector vehicles and they are dream cars. But the reality is you could buy one of these at auction probably for about $20,000. Not here at the show, mm -hmm. but that's about the value of some of these Ferraris. That's the starting price. Then they get up into the stratosphere into the $200,000 range for used Ferraris. And what takes it from $20,000 to $200,000? Um, the condition of the vehicle, the collectability of it. I mean, these cars here on this end are early 80s. Horsepower back then was down around 250 horsepower, somewhere in that range. Today, of course, the horsepower is way up. Performance is back. Mm -hmm. So you have cars that are uh, pushing you know, upwards of 400, 500, 600 horsepower. That's a powerful vehicle. It certainly is, very fast. Rick, how many people are we expecting to come through the doors here at the convention center? Well, you know, they had 40,000 people come through the doors here last year. Over the four days. Yes, and this year it's even bigger. It's on all four levels of the convention center, so mm -hmm. I'm sure that the attendance will top that number. And it's been segregated into seven different pavilions. Now, uh, how many vehicles all in all? Uh, 250 vehicles from 25 different manufacturers. Okay. And what's, what's the draw? What is the appeal from your perspective? It it's appeals to people on multiple levels. You can come here for one-stop shopping mm -hmm. to kick the tires of the new vehicles to see what's available. Husbands can bring their wives um, and shop together. You go from one manufacturer to another. That's the big thing here. Plus, you get a $500 cash coupon from the uh, new Car Dealers Association, which you can use toward the vehicle of a new, uh, the purchase of a new vehicle, mm -hmm. if you choose to do that. And then, of course, you can come here and look at these exotic cars and dream a little bit. And you'll see new technology and things like new electric vehicles. The the Tesla is here. The Fisker is here. Um, and even the Chevy Volt is here. So you see all of that new technology at play as well. And the Tesla that you mentioned, that's the top of the line electric vehicle in the building, right? It, well, it is, but the Fisker is top of the line as well. You, you have to get that from a Rolls Royce dealer. Um, <laughs> but the price there for both of those vehicles is around probably 100,000. The Fisker is about $120,000. Um, but the technology is there now. Uh, whether you buy the Volt or you buy a Tesla, which just came out with the new S model, which is their four-door version, and it's a little bit uh, lower in price than their, their first mm -hmm. creation. Uh, and those cars go 200 miles on a single charge. So now you mentioned that there's a giveaway. Yes, you could win the use of a Land Rover Evoque, courtesy of the folks at Land Rover, uh, a Range Rover Evoque, mm -hmm. courtesy of the folks at Land Rover, for a full year. All you have to do is fill out a ballot. Okay, and you and I were talking uh, earlier, uh, the attendance, men versus women, and you said that there's an appeal for women this year. I think there is. Sunday is family day, so it appeals to the, the whole family because there will be things for kids to do here on Sunday as well, mm -hmm. and through the, the whole weekend, but Sunday's family day. And, and women make up, I mean, they're involved in the decision to purchase probably 80% of all the vehicles, maybe more. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's important for women to come with their husbands and check out these cars and educate themselves so they make intelligent buying decisions. Definitely. Ricky, Rick, thank you so much for the chat. A reminder that the uh, Ottawa and Gatineau International Auto Show will be running here at the Ottawa Convention Centre until Sunday.